Hello everyone, this is Donald Barber with the J. Michael Manley team at Keller Williams Realty. And as we do from time to time, we promote local businesses in the area. And today, we are here at Hampton Station where a lot of things are happening between a brewery being here, a White Duck Taco, CrossFit, uh, studios, and one of the latest additions is Craft Axe Throwing. Uh, right here, this is Chelsea. And Chelsea, thank you for having us here. No problem. Uh, the first question I'd like to ask you, Chelsea, is is how long have you been at this location and how many are there other craft axe throwing um, businesses in the in throughout other states or other towns so we're actually the first one of our location and but there are two more opening up in Omaha and Springfield so out of the area of course and we've been here almost two months okay so a pretty short amount of time but business is booming that's great <laughs> Here we are at Hampton Station. What exactly made uh, the owners choose Greenville and Hampton Station in particular as a location? So Greenville is just an up-and-coming city. It's growing rapidly. They are the same owners of Greenville Escape Room, so they already knew that business did well here. Yes. And they chose Hampton Station just because it's so relaxed. It's a happen place to be, family-friendly. There's just a wide variety of people, so they thought this would be perfect to try and set up something new and unique and thought it would just be very welcome here. So Chelsea, I have an axe to grind with you. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I would love to know, because I've never played this and most people out there have never played, how exactly do you keep score in axe throwing? So the way it's scored is very similar in the way that you play darts. When you throw the axe, you're going to try and hit the target. The center of the bullseye is five points, and then it goes out from three, two, and one. It depends on what game you're playing, but if you're playing for a high score in the tenth round, if you hit one of the blue dots, it's going to count as ten points, and it's usually game over. So, what are uh, what are the prices uh, of the games here to play? So the most common one is the hour of throwing, and that's $20 a person. And each lane can hold up to four people. And often if you have a large size party, we do get you side by side so you're not split up from your friends. And then for walk-ins, we also offer a half hour option, which is $12.50 a person. Okay. So Chelsea, may I ask you another question? Why, of course. Uh, Chelsea, so um, exactly when you come in here and you've never thrown an axe before, uh, is there someone on staff that actually gives you maybe a few demonstrations? Yes, definitely. So when you come in, you're usually greeted by our staff as well as you're taken back to your lane by one of our experts. They are excellent throwers themselves and they will give you tips and feedback on how to actually make the axe stick in the target and how to improve your throw. So you're never left on your own and we definitely don't just put an axe in your hand and let you go crazy. That's good to know. <laughs> and one last question. How exactly could people find you either through social media or online to learn more about your business or to make reservations to come out and play? So we are on Facebook. We're Craft Axe Throwing Dash Greenville. And that has a bunch of our pictures and some information. Usually some random promos we'll throw up there as well. And you can book on our website, which is craftaxthrowing.com, and you just select the location for Greenville, South Carolina, and it has a reserve a lane button, and it shows you a little diagram of our facility, so you can pick which lane you want to reserve with your friends, as well as pricing, and there is our phone number should someone have any questions. Okay, thank you. So give Craft Axe Throwing Greenville a try here at Hampton Station and let me see if I can stick the landing and hit a bullseye on my first attempt. Look at this. It only took like 10 to 12 tries, but I almost got a bullseye. So come on out and check out Craft Axe Throwing in Greenville. It's a lot of fun and believe it or not, you get a decent little workout swinging the axe around. <laughs>